wonderful god bless you god bless you so so much all my viewers whenever that you are watching me from this is pastor Alice k from exodus 20 tv now sana all my viewers ladies and gentlemen whenever that you are watching me from from all over the world from diaspora ghana america cartel saudi arabia over kenya I salute you, I salute you so, so much. Thank you so much for your tuning in. Tune in and also share to your friend and also to your group. Na najua ya kwamba ibada ya siku ya leo itakuwa itakuinua na kukujega mara tena. Kwa hivyo marapote pale unapo nitazama uki safili kwa magari kwa madege kwa miguu kwa kazini kwa nyumbani karibu karibu kwa neno lake Mwenyezi Mungu just share and tell me where you are watching me from share go to our youtube channel subscribe and to our channel na Mungu atakubariki sana na tutakuwa tunafanya kazi ya Mungu pamoja niambie vile mimi madhabahu ya Exodus TV imekutendea wengi ambao tumesemeshana hakika Bwana amekuwa mwaminifu Ninasema sifa zote na shukulani ni zake mwenyezi mungu Karibuni sana maana mungu ajamarizana pamoja nawe Agari anakulana kutakia mema Malapote pale uko Kuna makusudi jema juu ya maisha yako Wimu nigetaka tu uigia kwa YouTube Subscribe, comment and also share uh, Na buwana ataeda kukubariki Hakika ye ni mungu You can drop your prayer request For cancelling and guidelines any question that you'd like to be answered, you are desperate somewhere, there is somebody to speak to you, kuna mtu anakugojea, atakushauli na kukuelekeza kwa jia zake mwenyezi mungu. Drop your prayer request, you, are, you may be sick, umechoka na maugojwa, kuna matibu, kuna kujibiwa na mungu na kuna uponyaji wake mwenyezi mungu. So you can use that number 0727 0727 Tumia lilo number for supporting na pia kwa saka na sadaka na ugetaka kununua kikobe cha maji Tumia lilo number na kika mwenyezi mungu wataida kukubariki All our supporters may God bless you whenever you are watching us Thank you, thank you so so much Akina Irene, Phil, George Kamau Everybody still there from Saudi Arabia Everybody who are supporting the ministry May God absolutely bless you because with God it work. Hallelujah for the glory and honor of the Lord. I'm saved. I love Jesus as my personal Savior. I've already made my own decision to stay in the will of God, not my will. The will of God be upon my life. And the same case, I know you are saved. You just tell me where you are watching me from. Na ugetaka pia kuokoka utandika na kika tutaweza kuoba pamoja na wewe na nitakutagaza nitatabua china lako for the glory and honor of the Lord. Wacha tuweze kuomba tuigie moja kwa moja kwa neno lake mwenyezi mungu. My Father in heaven, I call upon your holy name, O King of glory. We repent all our sins and we may, may thy will be, O Father, glory. I give you the honor and glorify your name once again, my Father. If it were not for you, where should we be today? Let the will be done upon everybody who is under my voice, O God. As I cover everybody with the blood of Jesus, wherever they are, all over the world, all over the country, O Father. I pray that your will shall be done upon us, O Father. As you are saving your people, you are healing the sick, you are lifting the heart, the broken heart, O King of Glory. Have your way upon your people, my Lord and my Redeemer. May this day, may you touch somebody, O God. May you use somebody, my Redeemer. May you touch the government, my Father and my God. I pray for the young generation, for the, uh, the old and the ages and the children, O Father. May thy will be done. Watch ibada ya siku ya leo, buwana ikateda kazi na wegi wakaokoka Jehovah. Ninaoba wepo wa romta katifu kaweza kuniogoza. Nitumie kama chombo chako cha dhamana yoyote atakaye sikia hii sauti bwana akaokoka na kubadilika na ni katika jina lako Yesu Kristo nimeomba na nimeamini hallelujah for the glory and honor of the lord kwa hivyo ujumbe ambao bwana ametia gani ya moyo wangu the promise of god are a and amina so if you are given a promise by god god will make it will make that day come promise with god with a covenant there is a promise that god have already promised 
promise you with that covenant. And our father can never break his covenant. Kwa hivyo mara pale uko kama Bwana amekuahidi atatembea pamoja nawe. Sikilia maono yako. Ni maana mtu aliye na maono awezi agaika. Mtu akiwa na maono awezi isha. Kwa hivyo shikilia maono aliyoweka ndani yako. Ni maana ameahidi hakika atakuwa pamoja nawe na atakusaidia. Obi the word of the Lord, hear the word of the Lord with the humility. When you honor the Lord, you honor the word of the Lord. Na ukinyenyekea naye Mwenyezi Mungu anakuinua kwa masafa yake. Kwa hivyo ni vyema kusikiliza. Usisikilize vile watu wanaogea juu yako. Masaa imefika ufate roho yako. Hear and obey your heart. Ukisikiliza moyo wako tenda mapezi ya Roho Mtakatifu na hakika utaenda kufauru lakini unapoangalia na kusikiliza ripoti ama opinion za watu hakika utaaibika i come just to tell you you are somebody somewhere Mungu ako na mpango mwema juu ya maisha yako usiyatazame vile watu wanakuona na kukuogelelea oh nasikia it is the time for our god is fulfilling our promises the god of heaven the god of ibrahim isaac and jacob amekuja atimize ndoto yako wimbo shikilia maono maana biblia sema ya kwamba umebarikiwa ukiwa ukiwa na maono hilo mafuta aliyokutia ataipigania ni maana aliyekutia mafuta na akaweka maono ndani yako yeye ndiye Jehova Mungu Israeli Isaka na Yakobo ili ya kwamba alikuchagua kutoka ulipokuwa tonde la damu kwenye tumbo la mamako tenda mema nenda zako oh ukisikiliza sauti yake Mwenyezi Mungu Hakika mapezi ya Bwana ni kutenda mema. Ni maana Bwana anasema ya kwamba nina wawaza mawazo mema ambao sio ya kuwadhuru ni ya kuwatenda mema. Kwa hivyo jipange sawa sawa wakati huu. Tunajua ya kwamba ni wakati wa campaign. Usipotize uhai wako ndugu yangu. Usipotize maono yangu ndugu yangu dada yangu. Ni maana haya yote itaisha. Kuna wengine wataingia kwa mambo ambayo itawaangamiza. Kuna watu wengine watajiigiza kwa hizi mambo watakufa. Kwa hivyo shikilia neno lake Mwenyezi Mungu ni maana yeye ameshikilia wai wako ukiwa na humility obey the instruction of God hear the voice of the Lord let us continue praying ni maana tuko katika mlima tunaomba tunaombea nchi yetu ya Kenya tunaendelea kuombea dunia mzima ni maana tuajua ni nyakati ambazo ni za mwisho hili kusikiliza sauti ya Bwana sio kusikia maana ukisikia utayasahau sikilia sauti ulilopewa na nilosikia siku ya kwanza na ukisimama kidete katika neema ya Bwana ukishikilia maono yako hakika utaachwa kama umesimama imara ni maana wakati umambo ni mabaya shida na matatizo ni nyingi mafa yamejaa kila mahala watu wasiopendana watu ambao wako na kiburi watu wasioheshimiana ni maana Isaia nabii alitabiri akasema haya yote yatakuja na wakati mtu mwenye hekima atakao yaona haya ajue ya kwamba Kristo yukaribu anarudi ni maana hii dalili tushaiona kwa hivyo jipange sawa sawa hili ndilo zamu lako simame kwenye neno upiganie neno la Kristo ukiwa ndani yake chochote kile unachohitaji kiko na Mungu jipendekeze kwa muumba wako Jehova Usijipendekeze kwa wanadamu ni maana wanadamu watakuacha tu ni wabatiri na Biblia inasema ya kwamba usikate tamaa kwake mokozi tumainia Jehova jipendeze kwake nasia be holy for he is a holy god follow the instruction of our father be be, 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 be strong in the word of the lord who oh, face your challenges with the courage because we know our father live in us so when you stand still with the word of the lord uta acho na yote umesimama usiasi Mwenyezi Mungu usikibirie pesa ambao sio za kweli usifanye anasa ni upate pesa hizo pesa zitakuelekeza kwa kaburi hizo pesa zimeelekeza wengi kwa hospitali wengi wamoko na matatizo maana walichukua pesa ambao sio halali kwa hivyo ni vyema ukoche bwana chochote kile unachohitaji Jehova ako nacho wacha tukae kwa magoti wacha tuombe zaidi tuendelee kuomba ni maana chochote uhitaji kiko kwa Mungu heri kupendwa na Jehova na maana wakati Jehova kwa upande wako hata kama utakuwa na changamoto Jehova God will make a way for you because Jesus is the answer where there is a question Jesus is the way maker are you somewhere looking for a way to come out of that problem my dear sister my dear brother there is a way because Jesus 
is the way maker. Jesus is the way maker. We will make a way for you. Jesus is the healer. I'm talking about the Redeemer River. The Redeemer Jesus, the Son of God. If you want to be healed, Jesus is the healer. You're going to receive healing in the mighty name of Jesus. Jesus is the way maker. He's going to make for a way for you. Kwa hivyo kibilia kwa ke Yesu Kristo. Yesu diya mponyaji. Yesu diya mtetezi wa kweri na aki. Yesu ukimuiguruda. Ukiachiria buwana akutaware. Kwenye kesi yako atafanya lilo kesi. Wacha utetewe na Kristo. Wacha Kristo wana bari moja maishani mwako. Nibesha ona mungu. Mmm. Anaponya watu wengi amesaidia watumishi amewashikilia wakati walikuwa kwenye maji mengi hata ukiwa kwenye moto mwingi yeye yeah, anaweza yeah, Mungu wa Israeli surrender to Jesus and when you love Jesus I have fallen in love with Jesus cuz in Jesus there is everything that I desire my dear sister and my dear brother commit yourself to the work of the Lord oh my god ni masaba ni mwisho be committed to the work of the Lord and when when you serve your God with a pure heart, it is not about your friend. It is not about whoever is an enemy and haters. Focus to the word of the Lord. Because the word of the Lord will make you stand once again. The word of the Lord will make you smile. The word of the Lord will heal you. The word of the Lord is the waters of life. The word of the Lord, it is the blood of life. So what I require most in my life, I just need to walk with my Savior. I desire to do the will of my Lord and to obey the instruction of my Savior because I know my Redeemer will redeem me. I don't care what I pass. I don't care what people say about me, but I'm focused to the word of the Lord. Am I doing the will of God today? Am I obeying the, all the word of the Lord today? So where you are, my dear sister, just question yourself. Are you in the will of God? Then when you are in the will of God, even if if you are passing over waters, even if you are passing over fire, God will make a way for you because victory is already in you. Because Jesus Christ is already in my spirit. You are the body of the Christ. You are the altar of the Lord. My body is the altar of the Lord. So I know in each and every circumstance uh, there shall be a way. Commit yourself. Uh, be holy for He is a holy God. Uh, with humility, humble yourself, and God will lead you to a standard uh, where the devil will not destroy you. I usually tell you, life is very short, my dear sister and my brother. Pesa zuwezi kukupati au hai. Rakini leader sana moyo wako. Na utumia masaa ya vizuri sana. Na usinyoshe kidore kwa watu. Watch it to obey serikari, wacha tusimame kwenye pengo, ni maana tukisimama chioba katenda majabu, yeye diya suru, yeye diya nae okia na kutenda, kwa hivyo siba wa yuda nasema ya komba, tutakapo mtegemea u jehova, tegemea chioba kuliko mari yako, tegemea chioba kuliko vile vitu ukonazo, atakae tegemea chioba, na tazamie guvu za msaraba, tazamie guvu za msaraba, ni maana likufa na Kafufuka. Jesus the son of God Jesus the son of David If you are committed to the word of the Lord If you are somewhere praying for the will of God to be upon your life My dear sister, my dear brother Rapaganda You shall not be destroyed You shall not die before time You shall be somewhere Worshipping and glorifying the name of the Lord Commit yourself to the Lord And dedicate yourself to your maker Dedicate your children to your maker because this is the time when so many people are doing so many bad things. Ma mother bow me gime inulua ya kishetani. Kwa mabarabara mother bow me inulua kwa mashetani. Kwa hivyo watu wa mungu inua mother bow. Dedicate yourself to the Lord. Dedicate your family to Jehovah so that you are going and coming back you shall be saved. Miteko me gime wekwa. Lakini alie na eki mataji dedicate kwa mungu. When you make a covenant to you when you have God. God will surely take care of you. And you are not saying, my ear not to put a word to any ekima. Ni maana mungu apendi wa pumbavu. Anasema tuobe ekima. Kama kuna yoyoti ya maya na ekima. Na tuobe ekima. We are dedicating our children to God. Dedicate yourself to God. Dedicate your husband to Jehovah. Rabba God of Rimazaya. And Jehovah God will cover you. Jehovah God will cover you and secure 
sure you, you are going and coming back. Commit your mind to the word of the Lord. Because only God can do. Only Jesus can make a way for you. And only Jesus can rescue you. So remember this. Ni wakati wakueka nathiri na mungu wako. Weka nathiri diyo baba kurinde. Ni maana masafa imefika nyakati za muisho. Tenda mema nenda zako. Commit yourself to the work of the Lord. By praying and focusing to the word. Giving God sacrifice and telling Jehovah God. I thank you my redeemer. My God. Oh my father. I have a thank giving in my soul. I have a thank giving in my soul. In my soul for the Lord is good. Sio kwa sia kukuwa kwa raisi. Lakini kupita kusika masiku ya leo. Haikuwa raisi. Kumekuwa kugumu na kubaya. Lakini I give God all the glory. We are praising and worshiping God for what he is doing today. Because we are breathing. We are still in salvation. And nothing will make us wonder. We are not going to be moved by any situation. I give God all the glory and honor. I worship you my redeemer for that day. I glorify God for the salvation. My God. I have a thanksgiving in my heart. My dear sister. My dear brother. Give God all the glory and honor and thanksgiving. Because of your family where you are. Because of the job that you are doing. Because he is the same today tomorrow and forever. And he said come all those who are heavy burden. I shall give you a rest. So it is the time to understand what God is doing nowadays. We are living in the day that those who are very bad. The man will not be unatimia. So cast your burden to your maker. Oh Rapaganda Rima. Cast all your burden unto maker. To your maker. Focus to the word of the Lord. Because the promises of God are in Amina. Do not focus to your haters and your enemy. They are already behind you. Do not reason to what they are saying. Do not stand with the opinion of people. But for God is telling you, focus to the word. Be holy for He is the only God. Commit yourself to the work of the Lord. And surely our Father in heaven, He is the Lord and King of glory. He will lead you to where you are going. You are not going to be sick. You are not going to die. So Ribagada, premature death and accident in the Lord. But God is going to secure you when you commit yourself to the word. I shall be somewhere worshiping and praying. Commit yourself to God because He is the Lord and King of glory. Everything shall come to an end, oh God. You are given this time to recognize the will of God upon you. You are given the other short time to recognize and to honor God. Only God can do. Only God can help you. Only God can sustain you. Be holy for His holy God. God can never be defeated. If we ring on the word of the Lord. If we walk in the will of God, He is a pure God. Oh, He is the Lord and King of glory. He is saying, come all those who are heavy burden. Do not move here and there looking for money. Money will kill you. Oh, Rabbi God. Pesa siyo uhai wako. Niwegi wako kwa maspitari na wako na pesa nyingi. Niwegi wamerana kwa mauti na warikuwa na matajiri. Warikuwa na majina ya kifanwi. Rakini siku ya lewa kama mbumbini, dugu ya guwe diyo meachua na mini meachua ukipu sikibizane na utajuri eri chuge kibia kwa yesu, eri chuge kibia kwa msaraba imana kwa msaraba kuna ukobozi kwa ke yesu kuna kurindua kwa ke yesu hakuna madhara, lakini tukikibizane na mautajuri utaacha utajuru dunia imana sisi wote ni manjua dugu ya gudada yangu tuwa ya kobo mepe wa wakati wa kutumu umepewa wakati wa kukaa kwa mungu sisi wote ni manyuwa tulitoka kwa mchanga tutarudi kwa mchanga masaa ya mefika jehova natafuta watu wanye haki wa mama wataka oba ya taifa waze na vijana wataka oba tukioba baba tajibu maomi hakuta kuwa mwagaji wa damu mana kutapatika na waobaji sio wana otafuta hera imana pe Zina wanasa nyingi Wacha tutafute kuriso Na chochote kile tunacho itaji Itatufuata Maana baraka za mungu Hazi 
mavazi na majozi Wacha tuobe watu wakubwa Wacha tukae kwa magoti Na kika cheo batajibu maobi yetu Ni masaa ya kusimama imara Ni masaa ya kutebea na ndeno la jehova Na ni masaa ya kusikiliza loo yako Sio vile watu wanaogea Usivutwe na mambo ya watu vile wanaogea Kama unatinda mema endelea Jehova ta kutetea Jehova ta jithurisha jani yako Ata kama umeachwa peke yako nugu yangu dadagu Jehova ta ogea I hear the voice of the Lord saying Why should you worry when your father is calling you Why should you panic in life Jehova God is saying he will comfort you Jesus will make a way for you Jesus will heal your heart and your future He is the Lord and King of glory He is not a respecter of person He is the voice of the Lord Jesus is saying if one way shall be committed If my people shall be Shall obey the word And the instruction of God They shall dwell in this world They shall receive peace from the Lord Follow the word of the Lord Because he is the Lord And king of glory Jesus is calling everybody for salvation Ah come on for salvation If you want to live long and live If you want to be healed And be sustained under the sun Oh hear the word of the Lord Obey the word of the Lord Jesus is calling the kings The elders, the young generation And the white water Kwa wako Don't him call Korewe na Christo Ni mana masaya Dio masaya wako Anaoko ata ifadi Yeye ni mwaminifu kwa wako wake kwa hivyo kiburia kwake Mungu nawe utakuwa salama nataka tuingie kwa neno mara moja Yeremaya 17 kuanzia hapo saba tuelewe mtu kubarikiwa ni nani je mtu kubarikiwa ni yule amejenga majuba makubwa je mtu kubarikiwa ni yule anapeleka maprado je mtu kubarikiwa ni mwenye mali mingi hapana leo tutaelewa mtu kubarikiwa ni nani ni maana kubarikiwa sio pesa na mautajiri baba tatufunuliwa je mtu kubarikiwa ni nani ndio nawe nami utamani kubarikiwa siku ya leo na ninasikia uwepo wa Bwana umeshuka wewe utakuwa mtu kubarikiwa ukimtegemea Jehova ukitegemea Jehova sio kutegemea biashara biashara inaweza aguka nyumba ya mawe inaweza boromoka watu wanaweza kukutenda watoto watubo yako wanaweza kukusahau lakini kunalo jambo moja ambao baba ameokea na moyo wangu ni kutegemea Jehova are you ready to focus to your god utaweza kutegemea Jehova Hautategemea pesa zilio kwa benki Ni wagapi wamekufa wakaacha pesa kwa benki Ni wagapi wamekufa wakaacha magari za kifahari Ni wagapi leo sasa hivi wameaguka na magari wamekufa Wameacha manyumba za bagorofa Wameacha machina makubwa Ni wagapi wamerana ICU Ni wagapi siku ya leo Wamerano rana razwa kwa maspitari Ama wakona pesa chungu nzima Abawa wakona mari na mashamba Laiti lakini mashamba ikuwa saidia Hata pesa zao zikuwa saidia Mari yao ya hayaku ya saidia Mana msaada watoka kwa Jehova Musaada utatoka kwa marafiki Uwenda ukawa ukona marafiki wendi Hata ukiwapigia simu wakati wa shida Watakuja wakulete mwana pesa Lakini mwana pesa ana suru ya maisha yako Watawugama kwa nyumba yako Waje na mamirioni wakulete kusaidie lakini hizo pesa hazina uhai watakuletea mambo mengi lakini hazina uhai heri kukibiria na kutegemea Jehova ndugu yangu utaacha kutegemea marafiki usitegemee mali ile uko nayo usitegemee wale watu wanakupenda bali kuna tegemeo ukishakubali kutegemea Jehova yeye ndiye ako na uzima wa milele yeye ndiye atakuhifadhi moyo wako yeye ndiye atategua mitego kwa barabara yeye ndiye ataziba mashimo barabarani yeye ndiye atazuiria we kuaguka na gari yeye ndiye atakuita kubarikiwa na hivyo itakuwa unapoondoka utaondoka kwako nyumbani ukiwa umebarikiwa na kurudi kwako utakuwa umebarikiwa maana kenini nitamtegemea Jehova nitamtegemea Jehova tegemea Jehova ndugu yangu masafa imefika tegemea Jehova mtumishi wa Mungu president tegemea Jehova Ruto te 
kutegemea Jehova hakika Jehova atashindwa wakati tunajua ya kwamba sio kwa umati wa watu sio kwa silaha za vita bali ni kwa neno lake moja wahitaji neno lake Jehova neno moja tu na utachomoka kwenye lilo shida huko ah sio mabirioni ah sio mambo ya kifahari lakini neno lake moja tu litakufanya uondoke tena litakufanya usimame tena mahitaji yako ni neno moja tu hili neno limekuja nani atakaye kubari leo kubarikiwa na Jehova kubarikiwa ni nani wacha tuelewe amebarikiwa mtu ule anayemtegemea Bwana Raba Ganda amebarikiwa ule mtu ambaye ametegemea Jehova tele kuna mama atategemea Jehova tele kuna mzee atategemea Jehova tele kuna kijana atategemea Jehova kuna mtumishi wa Mungu atategemea Jehova haijarishi uko kona gani haijarishi wamekuchafua jina lako haijalishi uko kona gani Rakini kubarikiwa ni anayetegemea Jehova si leo tumtegemee Jehova si leo tutegemee Jehova kubarikiwa ni anayetegemea Jehova maana tege wa gani wategemea Jehova waura na kunywa kwa kumtegemea samaki barini wanategemea muumba wao maana hata wao walitoka kwa neno moja tu wanyama mwituni wategemea Jehova hawafanyi kazi hawaendi kuhurada randa bali wako na tegemeo tunaangalia tunaona ya kwamba oh ndege wana directiwa na Jehova hamna yoyote anarara cha hamna wanyama wanakosa chakula bao madhiba ganda hata samaki hawakosi chakula kwenye bahari maana wategemea Jehova je siku ya leo Jehova sema ni ya kwamba amebarikiwa atakaye tegemea Jehova mfaume atakaye tegemea Jehova huyo ndiye ataweza kuona ukuu wa Mungu maana neno ni moja tu Jehova kibendezwa nawe hata kama watakataa watashuhudia ukuu wa Jehova hezi kubaki peke yako ukabaki na Yesu heri ukabaki na Yesu ni maana Jehova atakuwa backup yako kubaki na Yesu amebarikiwa na tegemea Jehova usitegemee warinzi maana hata mawachi manurara wengi wanasema wako na security ma security hawezi kukusaidia wengi na wako na maubwakari wengi na wamewekwa mawa security nyingi lakini abaya amebarikiwa riba ganda ndiye anayetegemea Jehova kama murinzi wake kama kiburio lake kama msaada wake kama nguvu zake huyo ndiye amebarikiwa oh siku hii ya leo situkubali tubarikiwa na Jehova ah ni kumtegemea tu wala pale uko sasa inukaza kumtegemea mambo yanaweza badilika lakini ni neno 2000 years ago it was the word of the lord we were by the word of the lord today there shall be a war for your situation even when you trust on your maker kutegemea jehova masaya ukiondoka utapata kazi maana nitategemea jehova hata kama walikuacha wengine walitukanwa sana ukaachwa na watoto wako na wakakusao ukaachwa na mume wako na akakusao bibi yako akakuacha na akakusao nimekuja ni kwa mbinu sio mwisho yako wewe tegemea jehova wewe tegemea jehova heri kubaki na kristo kristo atafanya kuwe na njia mm. Prito atakusaidia Prito atakutia my god Kristo atakubeba kwenye gogo kubarikiwa ni nani ni anayetegemea Jehova usitegemee hera lililo ndani ya mfuko wako usitegemee pesa lililo kwa benki huenda zitakuliwa na wengine lakini ukitegemea Jehova utapata vishindo oh kutegemea
kutegemea Bwana. Habari Bwana tu ni tumaini lake. Tumaini lako niwe kwa Jehova. Ninatumainia Jehova atanishidania. Ninatumainia wewe ni umba. Yeye ni mkuu kuliko vile nilivyo. Nitatumainia Jehova maana atakuwa kama mtu uliopandwa kando ya maji. Una Uenezao mizizi yake karibu na mto utakuwa kama mti ambao umelekezwa kwa mto hautanyauka wakati wa jua hautakauka kabwe meana mizizi yake imelekezwa kwa mto anayetegemea tu Jehova tegemea Jehova hiyo biashara itasimama hilo huduma itasimama wewe utaenda bari ni maana Jehova yumo ndani yako amesema utakuwa tu unamtegemea hayo mwingine muachie Jehova utegemee ya ataweza anajua mapezi yake yatatendeka muachie utakuwa kama mti umepandwa kando la maji hautanyauka wakati wa mabaya hautapatwa na janga wale wanapotegemea Jehova majaribu mashida yakija yote utayaweza watu wakikuinukia adui wakikutakia mabaya Jehova atateta nao atateta na maadui zako atafanya kuwe mnajia atakuwa gazia kwa kumtegemea wacha utegemee Jehova hiyo familia tegemea Jehova kwa hiyo familia yako tegemea Jehova kwa hiyo masomo yako muachie Jehova siku ya leo ni maana utasimama tena tumaini ya kwamba i shall be well with me declare where you are i shall be a hero i'm not going to be a zero i will trust on my redeemer i will focus to the word of the lord because god is not a respectable person i know god is watching you from a distance all reply at that trust on your maker more than ever he is the one maker saying i will make a way for you do not trouble yourself no by power no by might but by the power of the holy spirit of god that says the lord trust in and obey the lord hauta hauta na hofu wakati wa hali ujapo hautakuwa na hofu kama huu wakati unapokuja wa uchaguzi wewe hautatetemeka hautakuwa na hofu maishani mwako maana umetegemea Jehova hautatigizwa na dunia ikitigizika ni maana dunia inatigizika lakini kwa kutumainia huu Jehova wewe hautapatwa na hofu wewe hautaogopeshwa wewe hautakuwa kwa hatari maana utamtegemea Jehova bari jani lake litakuwa biti wala uta hagaika mwaka wa uchache wa mvua hautagaika watu wameanza kuagaika wanajiuliza kutaendaje lakini anayetumainia Jehova yeye hataagaika tumaini lake ni kwa Mungu msaada wake ni kwa Jehova uponyaji wake ni kwa Jehova yeye ndiye mrizi mwema wewe usiagaike usiagarie kule na kule usisikilize sauti ya watu tazama msalaba the finish work of the lord yeye amesema usiagaike tumaini ya Jehova uko mara pale umefika mwisho yako wewe oh, unataka kuja kwa uchaguzi tumaini ya Jehova wewe oh, usiende kwa wagaga na wagaguzi wote wameachiliwa moto kazi yote ya giza ni moto tunapinga kazi yote ya mwovu shetani tunategemea Jehova atakaye reta mwagaza atakaye gaza dunia yote atakaye gata wakati wa watichi yetu wakati wa uchaguzi tunategemea Jehova usiagaike usiendende hapa na pale tegemea Jehova tukae kwa maombezi siku ya leo mwagaza utaga ukikubali kumtegemea uko mara pale uko na shida umegochika unauliza maswala mengi huduma yako ye ni sawa tegemea Jehova oh my father dedicate yourself to god wakati huu wa uchaguzi dedicate your family to god we are praying for the young generation let us pray for the young generation let us dedicate our children to god because god will take care of them because we if we don't dedicate ourselves to god the devil is moving shetani anaua anagamiza na haribu kwa hivyo tusimame kwenye pengo ndio tuombe tukae kwa maombi ndio bwana aweze kuonekana ninatangaza wewe ambao ni mgonjwa receive your healing in the blood of jesus tegemea jehova na hiyo ugonjwa inatoweka tegemea jehova hiyo cancer imeondoka hiyo diabetes imeondoka hilo boma 
yako itasimama baba takushidania tumainia jehova hadri plus hautashidwa madui yako watarudi nyuma hautaondoka pale bila vishindo simama kidete tumainia jehova mtu ambaye amebarikiwa ni anayetegemea jehova siku ya leo nataka nikuombe hilo biashara utegemee jehova na hakika utaona vishindo hilo huduma tegemea jehova hilo doa lako tegemea jehova dedicate yourself to god dedicate your children to god be dedicated to god ni maana ukiwa dedicated jehova nakushuhurikia na chochote kile kiko dedicated shetani hawezi kukikaribia hata ye anajua kuna amri hawezi karibia na ndio tunamuona hana alipo dedicate mtoto wake akamwambia ili nitakae zaa nitamrekesha kwa hekaru shetani hajaweza kumkaribia so dedicate yourself to god ni maana mchafuko huko madhara iko vifo ziko maugojo ya chungu nzima ajali ziko but when you are going to be committed to god and dedicate yourself to god you shall be saved you are going and coming back ni maana ni mungu utayavuna upadacho tenda mema yatakufuata ni maana ni jehova thank you so so much nataka kwanza tuombe wacha tuombe pamoja nawe Baba katika jina la Yesu Kristo naomba kwa ajili ya watazamaji wangu wote mahali pale wako. Ninaombea nchi yetu ya Kenya Jehova, ninaombea Vice President my Jehova my River, tunapeana mikononi mwako Ruto my guy na familia yake Mesia mahali pale yuko. Hata President tunawaombea Jehova wewe ndiye mtetezi wa kweli na haki. Umesema ya kwamba kubarikiwa ni anayekutegemea. Tumetegemea jina lako Jehova. Tunakabidhi Vice President mikononi mwako na familia yake Jehova umesema ya kwamba wakutegemee tunakutegemea Jehova tunakataa umwagaji wa damu tunakataa watoto wetu kuagaishwa tunakataa maro yote ya kishetani tunavuja nira zote na miarati yote ya mwangu shetani mipango yote ambayo imepangwa juu ya kuhudhuru na kuagamiza vijana ikasharabatika kwa jia saba tunatangaza vijana wako kwa damu ya Yesu tunatangaza uchaguzi itakuwa mikononi mwako maana umesema wa ukubarikiwa ni wale wanakutegemea ewe Jehova Mungu wa Israeli wewe ndio utatenda kazi yako nina mimi na damu ya Yesu Kristo nchi yetu yote natangaza dunia yote hamna vifo premature dela kwa barabara ninatangaza damu ya Kristo watumishi wako wako kwa maombi Jehova tunajua una unajibu maombi wewe ndio unalo suluhu Jehova tunatangaza amani amani ya Bwana ile mahali pote pale makanisa ni kwa doa kuwe na amani kwenye serikali kuwe na amani chochote mshale wa mwao shetani tunauvunja na kusarabatisha jama roti ambayo limesimama kinyume kwa dami mambo mabaya ukaikemea jehova ukasarabatisha kazi ya giza ninaokea damu inaweza ninaokea vishindo ni katika yeremia 17:7 wamtegemea jehova wamebarikiwa ninatangaza watoto wetu tuwapea na mikono ni mwako ninatangaza dunia yote tutakutegemea jehova tenda mapezi yako wagonjwa wamepona wale wako ICU jehova wale wamekavia kanyigi kwa hospitali wengine wanawekwa damu na maji hata wajuika ni mchana mani usiku tunakutegemea siku ya leo bwana ukawaponya baba watoto wale wako ikubeta wamama wanaoza watoto wanajifungua tunakataa vifo my father tunakataa katika jina la Yesu tunatangaza watafunguka vizuri utarida watoto wako damu ya Kristo madaktari wote ni damu ya Kristo ninaomba siku ya leo wengi wakaokolewa wakachana na kukimbizana na pesa wakarisikia sauti yako wakakukiburia ndio wakawakubarikiwa ninakiria kwamba bwana wako na wazee wako mikononi mwako watumishi wote mabisho mabisho wote na wakabili mikono ni mwako wacha bwana ukawabariki ni madhao sebari basaya wamebarikiwa na kutegemea ninawatakia kila la heri ni katika jina lako Yesu Kristo nimeomba na niamini Hallelujah for the glory and honor of the Lord. Kwa hivyo sasa hivi najua umebarikiwa tayari. Aileen Waweno, how are you? May God bless you. Tayari umebarikiwa. Kubarikiwa ni anayetegemea Mwenyezi Mungu na kiwosho. Hey, 
inaendelea kwa kigosho worship and praise na warigima more than never hakika utakuwa umebarikiwa kwa hivyo hili na wewe endelea na kigosho sana <coughs> Endelea na kigosho sana maana ni wakati na nizamu letu sasa tu, tu, tunatumainia Jehova ni maana baba atatenda mapezi yake haleluya for the glory and honor of the lord thank you ruzi ruzi kigosho yendelee ruzi ruzi you are fair friend wonderfully created by god ninakutakia kila laheri ruzi ruzi ukiwa banana neno yendelee mtumishi wa Mungu ni maana hakuna jambo lingine lile bali ni kutukuza huyu Jehova na kukaa kadri ya mapezi yake Mwenyezi Mungu Irene Wawero may God bless you and your family endelea kumtegemea Jehova ni maana Bwana ameahidi atatulinda na atatuhifadhi ninakuona Anthony Kariuki may God bless you so so much May God sustain you, may God heal you because it's the Alpha and Omega. Tegemea huyu Mungu na hakika hauta aibika. Ninakuona sana sana ruzi ruzi may God bless you Philo Nyanz. Unasema dio tunamtegemea mpaka mwisho wa dawari. Unasema tunaomba tuko kwa maombi, tunaombea serikali, tunaombea kila mtu pray for your brother, pray for your sister, pray for your father, pray for your mother. We are interceding in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah Philo continue praying that some of those who trust in God will succeed surely we belong to the success beautiful we are going to succeed because our duty is to commit ourselves in prayer so we are praying that the will of God shall be done because while we are now over what time take me at Jehovah na kika vishido zitaenda kupatikana katika jina lake Yesu Kristo na kuona sana sana shikoshi may God bless you na kuona sana muso may God bless you ukiwa pale kawaida with God it was hallelujah for the Lord Smodoni ukiwa kawaida may God bless you once again because tuka na Mungu ambaye anatenda mambo makubwa ninakuona Beatrice Karioki may God bless you also thank you thank you so much for your tuning in na kuona Anastasia kutoka Nakuru may God bless you also pastor Jola Monene pastor Alex Wanjiro ukiwa Dika may God bless you Paul Kemani pastor Paul Kemani ukiwa Muranga may God God bless you. Hallelujah for the glory and honor of the Lord. Kwa hivyo sasa nawatakia kila laheri ni maana baba tayari amesema tunamtegemea na ni vyema usiongee sana. Be silent because silence is the greatest weapon to fire the devil. So we are praying tuko na kikundi ambao tunaomba, kikundi cha intercessors. We are praying for each other. So if kama ungetaka kugamba pamoja nasi, utapiga hiyo namba na utasemeshana na watumishi wa Mungu ili uwekwe kwenye the members wa kuomba kwa hivyo we are praying for the government we are praying for each other continue praying usiogee sababu amesema kubarikiwa ni kutegemea Jehova na mapezi ya Mungu yatakuwa kwa hivyo nakutakia kila laheri wacha nibarikishe saka zenu na barikisha yoyote ambaye ananyoosha mkono wako bwana all the new members father may you bless them once again wanaotoa kwa ajili ya kazi yako Mungu all the supporters may you bless them once again oh king of glory because you are the same today tomorrow and forever i bless their hands oh god i bless them where they are going they are going and coming back they shall be saved oh god wanao tebea watafika na kurudi kwa baraka wataenenda na kupata mkato wa kila siku baba ninawaita wabarikio ukawatilia baraka zako na kuwarinda mioyo yao yote iko mikononi mwako na ni katika jina la Yesu Kristo nabarikisha watu wote members wa imani wa church i commit them to the hand of king of glory wabariki wainue wapiganie umetenda mema Mungu Israeli saka na Yakobo ninawaita wabarikio Jehova wakienena na wakirudi wamebarikiwa ni katika jina la Yesu Kristo nimeomba na kuamini pia ningetaka kukukaribisha mara pale kanisani kwa na robi unapada matatu ya 106 unasukia kakoze petrol station za kawa Ukifika Kakoze petrol station za kawa utaupata ubao mkubwa umeandikwa Imano Exodus 20 church Igia mahala pale ama piga lilo namba secretary wetu Emily Edido atakujibu na atakuchukua mahala pale mpaka kwa kanisa ni kwa hiyo tu ubao utateremka kwa hapo kajia na utatupata mahala pale ukiwa na mgojo ambaye amekataa madawa ama umekunywa dawa umechoka uponyaji Kristo anaupeana buri usikae na hiyo ugojwa wako siku ya leo jo mahala pale utapata watumishi wa Mungu na hakika utapokea uponyaji na utafuguriwa kwa mizimu na kazi yote ya mwao shetani 
alitaisha utachukua uponyaji jo mara pale kuanzia saa nne paka saa tisa umekaribishwa sana ukitoka remuru utashuka banana kakose petrol station za kawa utashuka mara pale all over you are welcome you are very welcome jo kuja kwa miujiza yako uponyaji humo na pia ukobozi huko ni katika jina lake Yesu Kristo with the god it was and your life shall never ever be the same again nakutakia kila laheri siku jema yenye faraja with the